Welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. We are continuing where we left off in the last video. We're on episode 10, The Broken Sky. So without further ado, let us begin. All right, let's run up here and talk to these people. Regala's forces may seem strong now, but- Her machines took out my entire squad. Remember the visions. The old ones didn't choose their fight, but still, they stood firm. They didn't falter. And neither will we. Blood of the Ten. You've come to us. You know who I am? Oh, the warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Light. <laughs> yes. You are known to us. I am Decca, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's... there's something I need here. Anything you need, the Chief will provide. Come. Is that one of the visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the Ten. I can show you them, if you like. On the way to the chief. The visions? These visions. You said they're the records of the Ten. Who are they? Old ones. Who fought a heroic battle against machines on this very soil long ago. Their deeds are honored in the visions. <laughs> At least what remains of them. To be remembered and exalted. There used to be more of these visions? Many more. Once this place was filled with light and sound. But over the years, they've fallen into darkness. One by one. That is why chaplains are so important to the tribe. We remember all we can of the visions. Etched in our flesh. Passed down by word of mouth from generation to generation. One day the whole grove may go dark. But chaplains who come after me will keep the memories alive. Hikaro wants to see me. Why does Hikaro want to see me? We are at war with Regala. And you've already shown that you can stand against her. I'm not here to fight a war for you. Not for us. With us. But I won't try to persuade you. That is for the chief. He can be very convincing. Chaplain? What does it mean to be a chaplain here? We who outlast our youth study the visions and share their wisdom with our young. What kind of wisdom? How to be a true warrior. To fight with bravery and unflinching honor. And to know when to call for peace. You can see for yourself when we go inside. All right, to Hikaru. All right, let's go see Chief Hikaru. He's in his throne room at the far end of the grove. Come, be welcome among the records of the Ten. Excellent. Uh, watch the visions optional. So let's go over here and do that. It's glitched. Incomplete. Joint force ten active. 
led by the Emperor, the weapons were only the battle. The ten were dedicated soldiers, Keep moving. working together oh. as a squad and sharing in their duty. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. For the chief, it was one of the few things the clans had in common. Ten claimed ten seized <laughs> What's this one about? The Ten waged war against their enemy in the desert heat, a land too harsh for any to survive. But against all odds, they prevailed. So the Desert Clan does the same. You must have passed through their territory on the way here. It did. They sound a little extreme. They take that as a compliment. During their war, the ten climbed sheer rock, braving blinding snow and wind. They stopped at nothing to protect their own. You make them sound invincible. They weren't. But the visions tell us of their courage and strength. Something our soldiers aspire to. The Sky Clan admires this one above all the rest. They make their home in the mountains northwest of here. Soldiers in a jungle. Those were the ten? Yes. They knew how to use the jungle's depths to distract the enemy until the perfect moment to strike. Generations ago, my clan, the Lowland, looked to this one for inspiration as they claimed the jungle to the southwest. Okay. <clears throat> What's this? It was planted there by the chief. Ask him if you're curious. It's his tale to tell. Okay. The chief is inside. Are you ready to see him? Yeah. I'm ready. Good. Come. See you soon, Outlander. The savior of Meridian. I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. And defeated her champion, Grutta, in single combat. Impressive. I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior, and a man of honor. His death is a painful loss among many. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service, that could help considerably. I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. 
Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. You have named your price. Now I name mine. With my marshals dead, I need your spear. Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. I don't have a price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of marshals slain. I count hundreds more to knock whose lives hang in the balance. I will fight for them. I will kill anyone who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now and taking what I need to save everyone? You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. Fine. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the tribe together. Such warriors can only be promoted at a trial by combat called the Cool Root. I've sent out a call for the competition. But since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No. To defend the cool root. But there is more. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Tecote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit. Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold a cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Katala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, but he can still be of use. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stone Crest. Meet him there, and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. I think we'll just go north. Do what you want, and go north to deal with Dakota. But you'd better not forget about our deal. You will have what was promised, if you succeed. Speak to Deca on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. Excellent. So now we need to talk to Deca. This person. World recording. This box was speaking with voices of the old ones, but now there's noise over them. Let me take a look. Where did you find this? We took it from an Asaram Delver. She was trying to steal it and other artifacts from Tanakh territory. The others were going to bury it in the sand with her, but then I heard the voices. Well, the data here is badly corrupted, but. Delta Juliet 9, you are weapons free and clear to engage the swarm. Good hunting. Copy that. We'll buy Zero Dawn the time you need. Delta Juliet 9, out. The voices of warriors from the past. And that Osiram wanted to sell them for shards. The bravery of the Ten should be remembered. I'm not sure what you mean by the Ten. These voices came from the final battle of the Old Ones. Another battle? I could learn more about it if I could find the other boxes. That Delver did say there might be more recordings to be found in the wreckage of ancient flying machines. She claimed she had a way to locate them. Yeah. 
The box with the voice data on it is emitting a locator signal. I could use it to find the others. If you do then, bring them back here. I will see to it that they're treated with proper respect. Whatever sacrifices were made by these ancient soldiers, we will honor them. Excellent. Uh, trade in recordings? Recording. I'll take any you find. Uh, let me give you something for it. Trimmer husk underjaw tail storm bird storm cannon scorcher scanning ear let's do this one nice these voices will be kept here they will be remembered. All right, I'll be on my way. More of those recordings, I'll bring them back to you. Okay. My focus can detect beacons from those recording devices. Should help me to find any others that are still out there. Hikaru said you have something for me? A weapon to aid your mission. You'll need it for the long road to Stonecrest. Many machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's rebels in the area. Machines and rebels. Nothing I haven't faced before. Indeed. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend its slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll know you're in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. Excellent. Obtained cleaving, cleaving sharp shot bow. Sharp shot bows are powerful, highly accurate, long range weapons. They have reduced accuracy when fired while moving and cannot be aimed while sliding. Shoot elemental arrows to detonate canisters of the same elemental type. Very nice. We should probably tear precision arrows are now available for one of your sharp shot bows. These powerful arrows deal, deal high tear damage with a compressed air blast. Use these to remove armor plates from tough components or detach useful components. Excellent. So if we go into our inventory, we now have this bad boy. Let's edit the coils. No, well, I guess not. Uh, can we equip it? Put it here. <clears throat> Go. We have Deca, we have Caro, and Italo. Getting there. Okay. Holy cow, guy. You've been busy. Let me collect all this up. to go that way. Wow, that's a long way. All 
the way. Holy moly. Up there. Pretty gigantic map. Cool. So. I am going to head that way. I'll see you guys after I get there. Okay. So we made it up to where we needed to go. So. Let. get up here not one more step the Tanakh don't suffer outlanders in the clan lands I was given rite of passage by Marshal Fashav I'm not here to fight hair like blood this is the warrior who defeated Gruda champion of the traitor Regala her life is not ours to take you may enter but mind our ways you will be watched I'll keep that in mind. This must be Stonecrest. Catalo should be waiting for me. But maybe I should look around first. All right. Made it to Stonecrest. Thought a diary would be interested in this. Cool. My strength is yours. Hey. Cool. Stranger, have you ever? Are you looking to trade? this up here stews There we go. There's Catalo. Is that the champion? Ah, potions. From the east, I see. Really? Then I have something to share. <laughs> Listen to the rumor. What you've done for my people is known throughout the clan lands, Easterner. I'd like to help you if I can, lending you my eyes and ears. Nothing happens in this area without me knowing about it. In fact, I should tell you. They say you're a skilled fighter, Outlander. But I wonder how well you'd do against Ireo, one of our combat trainers at the Bulwark. Pretty sure I can hold my own, but it's always room to learn. Well said. Pay Ireo a visit if you can. Maybe I will. Okay. New melee pit. Uh, looks like we've got some machine strike up there. And then our mission's right there with that guy. Cool. One sec. Okay. Let's go talk to this guy. This valley is infested with Regalas rebels. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Some they ride, 
Others they herd along and some they even strip for parts. Especially cannons. The path ahead will not be easy. We should get going. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. Okay, Stonecrest. What is this place? Stonecrest was built as an outpost, back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. And for now, that means keeping watch on Regala's forces. I wish we had enough soldiers to do more than just look on. For all the good it'll do? For all the good it'll do? What's that supposed to mean? The bulwark has stood unyielding since the birth of our clan. Behind it, Tecote believes himself to be invulnerable. If he insists on defying Hikaru's orders, an outlander and a maimed marshal aren't going to change his <clears throat> mind. Your chief <laughs> seems to think differently. And that is the only reason I am still standing here, talking to you. Dakota. What makes you so sure Dakota won't listen to us? A snake safe in its lair hears nothing but its own rattle. Come on, is that all you've got for me? Hikaru said you were from the Sky Clan before becoming a marshal. I need to know what you know. Dakota is a petty, vindictive schemer. If he had any guts, he would have gone after Hikaru long ago. But instead, he covets the chiefdom from behind the bulwark, biding his time hoping that his foes will weaken one another. Is that enough for you? For now? Um... The bulwark? What makes the bulwark so impenetrable? It's made of massive boulders, impervious to any frontal assault. No army or machine has ever penetrated it. I am the only thing that can get you inside. If we're done talking, that is. Regala's machines. Why do you think Regala's forces are driving machines through the valley? We've heard similar reports from across the clan lands. The rebels are gathering machines from the wilds, but whatever control they have over them doesn't seem to last. So they herd them into camps. Something else happens there. Something... Something that makes their control permanent. An override with two phases. I... don't know about that. But it gets worse. We've heard rumors that the Rebels are scouting larger machines. I don't know what kind. Let's hope they don't learn how to override them, too. Hmm. You're still healing? You were at the embassy. I was. I'm sorry about the other marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. <clears throat> You're still healing. I will never heal. But that won't stop me from cracking any skulls that need it. Good thing you're on my side, then. <laughs> yeah, right. The way to the bulwark. So, what's the plan? The bulwark is to the southwest. So undoubtedly we'll have to cross paths with Rogala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through, or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. Hmm. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Right on. On me. You always got somewhere to go, don't you? Your 
How would you convince Takote to send his challengers? I wouldn't. <sighs> Come on. To knock the respect a blade, and the strength of the fighter who wields it. What good is anyone who lacks that? Well, lucky for us, we're both good fighters, but let's hope it won't come to that. Hmm. So this whole valley is the Sky Clan's territory? Yes. The clan has defended it for generations. Against who? The other Tanakh clans. Oops. There we go. <laughs> Even the Karja, long ago. If you want a history lesson, talk to the chaplains. When you left the grove, how did you know I'd agree to help Akara? Rebels ahead. Hacking away at that machine. Got them. Or sneak <gasps> around. The snow brought the chill. I will follow. Here and save. There we go. Get a strong color out of this. Those rebels were gathering machine parts, maybe to make more overrides. And Takote won't do anything? Why would he, when he has the bulwark? I grew up behind the wall. It's easy to have a full sense of safety there. More rebels in the clearing.
What's the word? Another watch. Another law. Pick against corrosive shock. Come on, come on, come on, get up, get up, get up. All right, next idea. An outlander and a one off man. And we're still too much for you. No, you're not. Take them out. They're done. Now let's go. Okay. Oh. They are quite a bit, though.
right, let's keep looking. Let's save. Let's get going. Back at Stonecrest, you said the rebels have been moving through here for days. By the time Takote realizes he's outmatched, this entire valley might be overrun. If not for the sake of the rest of the clan, I would welcome that day. To see his pride ruined. Here it is. The bulwark. Let me know when you are ready. Now I'm ready. We should not delay. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's go. A marshal requests an audience with your clan commander. I didn't know there were any marshals left. We defend the path to the mountain, where the wings of the ten shall find us. All right, marshal. I'll send the lift for you. Again. So this was home. A long time ago. Come on. All right. The last mark. Like we got another <clears throat> machine strike up there. Where are you going? Well, this is a warm welcome. An outlander and a maimed marshal. A spectacle. Reminds me of where I grew up. I never decided which was worse. When they shunned me or when they stopped and stared. Right now. We're here for Dakota. Let us in. The Sky Clan's mighty son returns. Bless the Ten. Your chief has demanded an immediate dispatch of all challengers to the Cool Route. We're here to make sure yours haven't gotten lost on their way to the Grove. I see. Regala must have dealt our chief a mighty blow, if he's sending you two as messengers. This one defeated Regala's champion, Grutta, at the Embassy. She fought honorably. I had the sense to bar our soldiers from that embassy. 
Just as I have the sense now to keep our challengers here. If they must fight, then they will fight here. Defending our walls, our clan. That wall won't protect you. Not from the machines Regala controls. They're already at your doorstep. <laughs> and what do you know of the battles that the Bulwark has withstood? The blood shed upon stone. I know it wasn't meant to be used as a coward's shield. You were a great warrior once. That was then. You tell Hakaro, with all due respect, that we will keep our challengers here for as long as we are safe behind the bulwark. I told you, words are useless with his kind. We're gonna have to kill him. It won't be easy with all his men above. Are you even listening? For as long as we are safe behind the bulwark, he said. Wait here. I need to get a closer look at that wall. What? Why? Because we're going to take it down. <laughs> Aren't we? Oop. Did not mean to do that. Meant to do that. I needed to practice. Some stew? No. Armor. Interesting. So in everything, they can help. Dies. Well, might not be as strong as Dakota think. Face paints. Hmm. I need to get down to the base of it and check it out. the base we go. distance from the wall in order to scan it properly. Okay, time to scan the wall. Just what I thought. There's something metal in there. Oh, that rock is interfering with the scan. I need to get closer. But how? Might be able to climb up on the left side of the wall near that waterfall. flowing 
into the wall. Oh, it's a hollow. Let's see if I can tie up them. Now, better scan that tank again. Power core. I'll bet if I blew it up. But how? Well, can't do anything else here. Better go find Catalo. Okay. said you've been scurrying around the wall like a rat. What in the name of the ten have you been up to? Dakota said he wouldn't send his challengers as long as they're safe behind the bulwark. Right? Don't remind me. So? We take it down. Did you hit your head on the way down here? I'm serious. There's something from the old world stuck in there, and it has a power cell. I could blow it up if I just penetrate the first layer of rock and Even metal. Even if what you're saying is true, it would take a cannon to do that. You're right. And you said the rebels were stripping them off machines back in the valley. Come on. No. I'm not getting dragged further into this madness. Hikaru ordered you to help me. You gonna defy him like that arrogant shit up there? Ooh. That was she has a point. Unkind comparison. That was an unkind comparison. <laughs> you know it. The rebels <clears throat> are in camp northeast of here. And then what? The two of us go up against all of them? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, you may lack sense, but you don't lack courage. So, um, back there with Dakota? It seemed like there's bad blood between you two. There is. If we make it through this plan of yours, perhaps I'll tell you. I'll hold you to that. All right, let's go. What? We're getting Off close me. to where we saw the rebels before. There we go. Well, it looks like the rebels just got a lot more firepower. Ready? Holy cow. Focus on the others. I'll follow you in. Here we go. Maybe I should see if there's anything I can use to take that thing down. My focus can help. Load up water. Chill water drum. With the, right ammo. the Sky Clan will fall. Chill water. Do 
Can we get behind it, maybe? More shots left.
Come on! You were supposed to get it. them. Go. I'm not looking forward to hauling this all the way to the bulwark. Mm. Here. I may be maimed, but I've still got a strong back. There. I did not think we'd survive, but killing the rebels and the machine, it was good to take the fight to them for once. I really think this thing will do the job. Who's that? Well, no, soon enough. The snowfall is blanketing the land. Survey drone. Back to the bulwark then?
Come on, big guy. Get over here. Here it is. But you don't just need a cannon. You need a miracle. Coming right up. Here goes nothing. Gotta blast away some rocks so I can expose the power cell. Isn't this impressive? Two children playing siege. I hope they haven't hurt the bulwark's feelings. Come now, stop embarrassing yourselves, and leave this <laughs> poor mountain alone. This is your last chance, Takote. You can still answer Hikaru's call. This is your last chance. You have it backwards. Leave this place, Savage, now, and take this cripple with you. Okay. Hide behind the wall anymore, Takote. Now you have to join Hikaro. Never. Never. We will. We will rebuild it. Immediately. You are not safe. The bulwark couldn't protect you from a single cannon, let alone an army of machines. The only pathway to safety is to unite against Regala with your chief. You decreed that no challenges would be sent, while the clan remained safe behind the bulwark. So send them now. Unless your word means nothing. Send them. I didn't hear you. Send the challengers. I look forward to seeing the Sky Clan's colors in the arena. Nicely done, Marshal. What's gonna happen to this place? They'll have to live without their wall. But that's better than living apart from the tribe, as pawns in Takote's foolish schemes. If you want to check up on them, talk to Jera, the chaplain of the clan. If anyone needs help up there, she'll know. Yeah, maybe I will. I'll take my leave then. I need to report to Hikaru. I'll see you at the culvert. Good. We may need another miracle there as well. It is true. Completed the Maybe broken sky. There. See if everyone's all right. And find this chaplain, Gara. Might also be a good idea to resupply before I head back out. The Colroot 
is the next main request. Leveled up again to 19. Okay. Well, everyone, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button. If you're new around here, please subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.